943, and today 1A Distilling right here in D.C. is putting its first gin on the market, Ivy City Gin. And our Julie Wright is live this morning to tell us more. Julie? Last year at 1A Distilling, I've never been, I've never been here before, and it's a blast seeing how everything is put together, it comes together, and the best part about it is it's all local. Hey, Gerald, uh, Jared Early, how you doing? He, hey. he gave me a shot earlier, so the names are just not flowing the way they should. How you doing? Doing fantastic. <laughs> Thanks for being here. It's our big Ivy City Gin launch tonight. I and know. We have a big party coming up. Uh, guest bartender David Fritzler from Trish Restaurant Group is here to whip up some tr tr ah, fantastic cocktails. He had a shot, too, earlier. I got to tell you, though, in all seriousness, we do want you to drink responsibly and have a good time. But the event tonight, 50 bucks gets you what? $50 gets you a first batch signed bottle of our gin along with two cocktails whipped up by David. And you know, one of the best things about this local Ivy City gin is a dollar from every bottle sold this year benefits Habitat for Humanity projects in our neighborhood of Ivy City. And that's, the, that's one of the hot spots about this place is that everything is local. We've talked earlier to Alex and we were learning that the grains and the botanicals are local. Even our marketing promotion here is local. I love that about it. Yeah, we love the local partnerships and working with a restaurant like Trist and the Coop is just another way we're able to extend the collaborations. All right, Dave, tell me what you're making now. What's this thing called again? Well, we're calling this one a lucky bastard. So okay. it's based on... You might want to say that with some gusto. I mean, if he's going to be lucky. Lucky bastard. So <laughs> it's based on a suffering bastard, which is an old uh, tiki cocktail, okay. which has roots and kind of morning corrective. So it's a great drink for the morning, really. All right. Hey, any drink's good in the morning at ABC7 and News Channel 8. Now, a little cucumber flair to that. Why cucumber? It's refreshing. On a hot summer day like today, a drink like this is going gonna, is gonna to go down easy. <laughs> yeah, the gin is very smooth. It tastes nice. It has a nice crisp flavor. Right, and we wanted to have feature cocktails tonight that would really show off the flavor of the gin, so it plays well with these other ingredients. Mm -hmm. Now, we were talking about the local flavor that you bring here as David continues to uh, work his magic. Some of the bottles that we saw earlier, the Rock Creek, mm -hmm. explain how, like, the marketing and all that, because it's fascinating. Yeah, so Rock Creek White Whiskey and District Made Vodka are two of other spirits, and we really wanted to call attention to the district and play, play out different elements throughout all of our branding. So on the Rock Creek bottle, for instance, you see a leaf that is native to Rock Creek Park. That's awesome. All right, and again, tonight it's $50. You get an autographed bottle, plus you get two different drinks served up by our one and only David Fritzler here. Absolutely, and you just uh, go to ivycitygin.eventbrite.com. There's a few tickets left, so get them this, this morning as soon as possible. And I, got, I know we're talking about tonight's event, but Whiskers and Whiskey is coming up in two weeks, and that's bringing your doggies in? Yeah, we uh, actually we're open every Saturday from 1 to 4 for tours and tastes, and dogs are always welcome, but we have a special event coming up too, so folks should go to 18distilling.com slash events for a whole list of the fun we have in store. See, and I like that idea because as our photographer Vanessa said, somebody's got to guide you home after you come in here. But again, drink responsibly, you guys. 18distilling, it's at 18D on Twitter. And again, is this drink ready to try? Let's see here. It's almost ready to try. we got to try this, guys. We don't want to... We don't want to leave you without seeing how this goes. Got to have the cucumber. All right, Larry, Atria, cheers. Yeah, cheers. <laughs> and, yeah, make sure you uh, don't drive home. <laughs>